Welcome back to the channel. Today we'll be taking a look at the money deleting and unreliable SUVs to avoid buying. Number 7. Nissan Pathfinder Meet the Nissan Pathfinder, once an off-road legend. Now rockin' the family van vibe. Forget the trailblazing days, it's all about school runs and epic quests to the grocery store now. But hold on to your shopping bags, because with this Nissan, transmission hiccups might just steal the spotlight. Yep, you guessed it. The Pathfinder has a bit of a rep for transmission troubles. It's like the celebrity scandal of the automotive world. But hey, that's not the only hiccup in this SUV's journey. There's a symphony of complaints, from a ride that's not winning any awards for comfort to electrical quirks that make you question the SUV's inner wiring. And let's talk airbags. They're supposed to be silent heroes, not annoying noisemakers. Some Pathfinders have airbags that decide to rattle and click, adding a percussion section to your daily drive. But wait, there's more. The windshield might throw a surprise party and crack without warning. A bit dramatic, right? It could be a hint of deeper issues with the chassis or build quality. Now buckle up for a ride through the complaint department. Vehicles shutting down unexpectedly, gas levers going on strike, and surprise vibrations on the highway. In the grand scheme of things, steering clear of a Pathfinder might just be the secret to your happiness. Number 6. Jeep Wrangler the Jeep Wrangler is a direct descendant of the legendary Willys Jeep from World War II. It's been the go-to vehicle for off-road enthusiasts worldwide, known for its reliability and dependability. Now, don't get us wrong. If you're into off-roading, the Wrangler might be your spirit animal. But if you're after a reliable daily driver, you might want to reconsider. This bad boy has a rap sheet that reads like a novel safety scores that make you raise an eyebrow, ride quality complaints, vibrations that'll make you question your life choices, and a not-so-pleasant habit of letting water crash your interior party. And it doesn't stop there. We're talking engine and transmission hiccups, cooling conundrums, electronic tantrums, body hardware woes, paint problems, and brake blues. It's like a Jeep buffet of issues. So, if you're serious about conquering off-road terrain, go ahead, make the Wrangler your steed. But for a reliable daily driver, there's a sea of better options out there. Number 5. Ford Bronco Sport Check out Ford's new Bronco Sport, the younger sibling with a taste for adventure. Geared towards the cool crowd, this pint-sized powerhouse is all about fun and capability for your everyday escapades. Picture rugged styling, decent off-road chops, and a ride that won't shy away from the urban jungle. Now let's talk about the not-so-great stuff. In its debut year, this SUV has had more recalls than a rookie on a roller coaster. Seven to be exact. But hey, don't panic just yet. It's not breaking records for the worst. Brake blunders and fuel system fiascos have been on the menu, potentially turning your joyride into a fuel-leaking standstill. And the fun doesn't stop there. We've got suspension control arms doing the limbo, bolts playing hide-and-seek in the suspension, and a moon roof that's apparently moonwalking because it forgot to bond correctly. So while the Bronco Sport is busy being the life of the adventure, it might need a bit of TLC to keep the good times rolling. Number 4. Lincoln Aviator All right, buckle up, because the Aviator is back in town after a 15-year hiatus. They're throwing around words like stylish, upscale feel, and latest technology to woo you. But wait for it. Is it worth the wait? According to the latest consumer surveys and reliability ratings, the answer is a resounding no. The Aviator strikes in with a defects and issues list as long as it's vacation from the market. It probably scores an impressive 8 out of 100 on the Consumer Reports reliability scale. Now, if that's not an achievement, I don't know what is. Someone give them a pat on the back, just not too hard. We don't want anything else falling apart. And let's not forget the trouble spots. Brace yourself for a laundry list of issues covering everything from in-car electronics to the paint job. We're talking climate system, steering, suspension, power equipment, body hardware, drive system, paint, trim, noises, leaks. Basically, every aspect of this SUV is a potential adventure. In a move that surprises no one, the manufacturer probably won't be featuring this reliability score on the glossy pages of their sales brochure. The aviator's best bet might just be to stay cozy in the past where it can reminisce about the good old days 15 years ago. After all, some things are better left as a nostalgic memory. Number 3. Kia Sorento Meet the Kia Sorento, the budget-friendly charmer in the world of vehicles. 
It's like the superhero of affordable options, giving you top-notch performance without burning a hole in your pocket. U.S. buyers are loving it, and the sales charts are doing the happy dance. But here's the plot twist. When it comes to reliability, the Sorrento decides to play a different game. Picture this. Engine head gasket failures that can turn your engine into a grumpy cat. And it doesn't stop there. Transmission and drivetrain issues join the party, along with some overall build quality problems. Brakes and ABS systems might decide to take an unscheduled break, and air conditioning condensers might decide they've had enough. Sure, the Sorrento is the budget superstar, but it's like that friend who throws a great party but can't keep a secret. So while the price tag might make your wallet happy, we'd suggest peeking at other options for a smoother ride without the unexpected drama. Number 2. Jeep Grand Cherokee Ah, the Jeep Grand Cherokee, a true off-road legend. And by legend, we mean it's legendary for both its off-road prowess and, well, let's call it a unique relationship with reliability. Now when it comes to the newer models, there's this recurring theme of transmission hiccups. It's like the Grand Cherokee went to transmission school but skipped a few classes on reliability. And don't even get us started on the questionable longevity. It's like the SUV is trying to keep us on our toes, or maybe our mechanic's toes. But wait, there's more. It's not just about the transmission drama. We've got a whole lineup of electrical issues, from annoying glitches that make you go, why, oh why? to safety concerns that might have you gripping the steering wheel a bit tighter than usual. And then there's the recall party. Rear coil springs deciding to detach, steering control playing hide and seek, and a missing dashboard airbag lie. Now to be fair, the Grand Cherokee does have its fan club. Those who love a big, family-friendly SUV with off-road chops and towing power find it hard to resist. But here's the kicker. Considering the roller coaster of reliability it's taken us on during those 30 years, recommending the Grand Cherokee. Well, let's just say it requires a certain level of adventurous spirit and maybe a good relationship with your local mechanic. Number 1. Volkswagen Taos. Let's wrap up our little journey through the land of questionable reliability with a bang, or should I say, a toxized explosion. This SUV didn't just make it to the unreliability list. It practically threw the list a farewell party, set the room on fire, and claimed the top spot with a dramatic flair. Talk about making an entrance. Now, onto the Consumer Reports reliability score. The Taos managed to score a whopping 1 out of 100. Yes, you heard that right. A single point. Maybe the 12-volt socket was the shining star in this reliability disaster. We could dive into a laundry list of issues with the Taos, but that would take longer than a feature film. Let's just say failing turbochargers, engine troubles, wonky electronics, sending mysterious messages, and fuel system problems are just the tip of the unreliable iceberg. But hey, a logo on the front or a nameplate on the trunk doesn't seal a car's fate. Reliability ratings are like relationship status updates. They're based on in-depth research and data analysis, not just a flashy exterior. So while we've highlighted some statistical underachievers today, Remember to make your decisions wisely. Agree with the list or want to share your own tales of automotive woe? Drop a comment below. And if you're up for more riveting car content, consider hitting that subscribe button. Until then, drive safely and keep those four wheels trouble-free.